E2 has been around for about 20 years now. Uh, we are a healthy Asian inspired food brand. Our mission is really to create and, and provide uh, healthy, affordable uh, food to everyone. I think like every job, when you start a new job, the first three months uh, is always quite overwhelming. It's a lot of new words, new techniques. We have very high standards they also need to follow and they need to learn that very quickly at the beginning. So that's the main challenge is for them to get to learn everything as quick as they can so they feel comfortable in their role. We, we have a saying it too. We say we put people at the heart of what we do. Uh, anything we do, we'll think of them first. So it's important that they're happy, they're motivated, they enjoy work, uh, and we want to give them opportunities. One of the things I really wanted to do from the moment I, I started this role in Itsu, I wanted to find a new way for people to learn. As much as I like books, uh, it's very plain. It doesn't appeal to everyone. It's very hard to manage content. You cannot update them as many times as you want. Attency for me and I think the, in the, in the business here is really the solution that I've been looking for for a long time. Since we introduced gamified learning, there's been such an engagement. People are doing it without being asked. People are doing it because they want to do it, because they're having fun, uh, and they realize they're learning through it. Uh, people can play, compete with their colleagues, try to score even more, so play and play and play again. It's like a dream come true. People do train a lot more than, than, than they would have normally. It's more exciting, it's more interesting and it's handy. You can have it in your phone and this is very important because we don't have time, but with this we can play on the train, we can play on the bus, you know. He created an atmosphere as well in the shops where they actually gathered around the grow up. We've been sent pictures of a, a team sitting during their break and they're all on their phone, which usually we would not agree with, but in that occasion it's quite fun. I was playing with my sister. My sister works for it as well, okay? Ah, okay. And so I was trying to beat her, you know, all the time. Okay. <laughs> and she the same. <laughs> L&D as a function is actually now really capable of supporting any initiative within the business uh, and making sure it's a success. So as soon as we have a new launch, a new product, we're changing a procedure, we're changing a recipe, we're changing a scoop, we can immediately put it through Grab and um, the training stays very relevant. We just created a module for a new product and we did that in 15 minutes. That's it. <laughs> Morning everyone. What we've looked at is the four week levers versus last year when we introduced actually decreased. So there's a, a great correlation uh, between that. And actually this is where it matters. What we look at is how many people are actually leaving within those four weeks using the app and the ones not using the app. And all that shows is that we see that people who've been using the app actually have been uh, leaving less. So that's for me a fantastic result. So the quicker people can master their role and understand, you know, they're more comfortable and at ease and happy they will be in their role.